everybody, it's Michaela, and this is Hannah. Hi. And welcome back to my channel. <laughs> this is one of my bestest, bestie besties. This is my bestie from Michigan. We call we call each other every day. Every like, single literally day. Every single day. So much tea. We always are like, I have updates. She currently <laughs> lives in Miami. All right, guys, you know the deal. I got a snack crate box this week. Let's see what it is. I'm excited. I love chocolate. I like chocolate. I love chocolate. It's melted. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> They're known for chocolate. So, as usual, the fun facts. Belgium is the world's second largest producer of chocolate after Germany. There are many different types of Belgian waffles. The Brussels waffle and the Liege waffle are the most popular. The term spa originated in Belgium. The town of Spa is well known for its popular mineral springs. Approximately 84% of the world's rough diamonds pass through Antwerp. The city is known as the diamond capital of the world. We're gonna start with the drink. It is a Fanta Exotic. Oh, it's just, it's I don't just know, like, a like Fanta? I don't know what flavor it is, though. We'll just, just it, crack it. Like it orange, as long as it doesn't have pineapple in it, I'm sad. She's allergic to pineapple. I found that at the it is range. Interesting. I don't know how I'm going to feel about this. Or is it grapefruit? It almost smells like grapefruit. Cheers. Cheers. It's actually really good. That is good. I like Wait, it. It's very acidic. So if you like like fizzy stuff, like Fago's always fizzy, mm, yeah. I see what you're saying, it is a weird aftertaste. It's like really fizzy and then there's none at all. It almost tastes like diet. Yeah, that's what it is. I don't like diet. It would be like, like fizzy lemonade. It's okay. I don't think I would just go get that. Like if I was in front of you, I would drink it, but I wouldn't be like, yo, I this really This looks good. Potato. It's a croaky Vicky. It looks like burger. Oh, wait, what? A croaky Vicky. <laughs> Vicky. <Bicky. laughs> <Bicky. laughs> You're a croaky Vicky. You're a croaky Vicky. <laughs> oh, it smells like burgers. I don't know how I like that. I'm kind of piggy though. Low key. I love crunchy snacks. I'm taking a small Cheers. Bite. Cheers. What a whistle. <laughs> I'll have another if it's good. I actually really like these. Wait. It tastes, okay, I know what this tastes like. Have you guys ever tried ketchup chips? No. From Canada. Okay, get those when you can because they're really good, but these taste like all dressed chips and ketchup chips together, but they're burnt. Like, like fake burgers, like you know fast food restaurant burger, that's what it kind of tastes like. I like these a lot, it's a yes for me. It's very vinegary, like a salt and vinegar chip, but it has like a smoky taste. I like it. Ooh, we got some Lay's, Lay's Grills, it says, Grilled fume. Wait, why is it actually in the shape of a grill? <laughs> <laughs> These look Sorry. like they're gonna be yummy in my tummy. They look barbecue-y. They smell barbecue. -y. Smells like a barbecue sock. They do. <laughs> they do. Um. No, 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 this that's is bad. bad. That's not, that's not. <laughs> I don't like that one. Yo, this is bad. This snack tastes like if you had all the dirty socks in the world and you shoved just, it into you had, one like, chip. Barbecue chips and just like sprinkled it over. Yeah, it really kind of tastes like a hint of throw up. I don't like that. I have the worst appetite. That sounds I like love this. these candies. It's Haribo, 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 pasta fruta fizz. Kids and grown ups love it. So I love these candies. I feel like I've had them here. I love sugary candies like this. I have a red one. Mm -hmm. Yup. Yeah, I like these a lot. I'm satisfied. Perhaps a snack rate, right? yeah, for it being fresh. Because a lot of times when you get like a snack, especially something like that, like they're stale, but that's like really gooey still. Confissieri and Buscatieri Artisanali de Puy's 1895 Gecopa. Wait, those are kind of good in the back. It looks like licorice almost. Is it licorice? Oh no, I don't know what it is. Wait, let me smell. It smells like fake raspberries. Oh, They're kind of cute though. They look like little flowers. It's roses on them. Cheers. Cheers, it's like my milk. Mm -hmm. I'll you. I think these are hard candies. These are good. These are just hard candies. Like, I'm patient for hard this. candy. I have to bite it. They're actually not bad. This I is like really grandma like candy. This Sorry, is not a candy I would go to the store and say, oh my gosh, I'm dying to have a Gikopa. But it's good. All right. right, next one. Here we go. Oh, Way. a chocolate waffle. It's a Susie Gouffer Deliz Lucas waffle. 
It's chocolate and a waffle. That's literally like what they're most known for. I feel like that's the Hostess of Belgium. Probably. Oh, it smells like a Hostess Zona, 100%. That's what this is going to taste like. I'm going to take that. Just what it tastes because they're really rich. You can tell that. Yeah. Much. Chocolate smells in my hand. Mm hmm. Mm. Crunchy. Mm hmm. The chocolate is crunchy. That's, that's weird. That's so good. That's weird, but I like it. This would be great with a glass of milk. Yeah. It's a Lotus Springy Pain. Why does it smell like sweets, but it also smells like chicken? Ew, it's so... <laughs> the longest thing now. <laughs> All right, let's go. I'm so confused by this. It tastes, it smells like a room. By a little room that's mm. in. Is it good? Reminds me of something I've had before, but I can't put my finger on it. I like it. No, for me. All right. Get something better, please. It's a Bochy Coat Door. Coated Door? Coated, is that how you say it? Yes. Coated Door? Code, right. coat, coat Dior? Who knows, not Coated Door, I think. Coat de Door. There's no two Ds in there. I've had this before, it's pretty good. There's a filling in it, I think. Am I right? There's a filling, yeah? Is it out of the world? Yeah. You went. Mm -mm. <laughs> I don't care. This is gonna make me happy. This is the kind of chocolate I want my man to buy me in the future, my future man, to buy me on Valentine's Day. And it's just like a heart shape with all coated the doors. Mm. This tastes like a, a richer three musketeers, but it's amazing. That makes me feel on top of all bougie. Like, hmm. I got this luxury chocolate in my mouth. It's so good. By far the best. Mm -hmm. My favorite snack. That's amazing. Yeah. Okay, we got a couple of these eclairs. I know what an eclair is, but. Whoa. These are caramels. Caramel eclairs. What is this? Is it caramel chocolate? I can't taste what the metal filling is. This is good, but the caramel overpowers yeah, the chocolate. Yeah, I don't like the caramel. I like, I'm a caramel person, but yes. this is like too much caramel. You can't taste the filling. Now we have Jules de Stroper. That is the silent? Mm -hmm. Jules. Jule. Jule. Jule de. Jule de. What if the person's Jules. name is just simply Jules? How do you differentiate? Oh, this smells like a Pizzelli. The, these smell like Pizzellis. Oh, these are like little wooly furs. That's cute. Oh, whoa. I like these. I actually do. I think when I said they look like Pizzellis, I was expecting Pizzelli. No, it's like a wafer. Yeah, they're just very thick. I like these a lot. I like it, but they're almost a little too caramelized. It's I think like that's graham cracker. Is. Like crushed up graham cracker or like a cone. They're not bad though. I'll eat them. I like them. I like it. Oh, we got a biscoff. We have these on Delta. Are these the Delta ones? Let me see. No, uh. It's Belichi chocolate to, it's chocolate. So like, it looks like a Milano cookie. I oh, think. I love Milano. Me too. But that's what I think it's like going off of. Yeah. I don't really like Biscoff cookies though. I never eat them on my Delta flights. I never eat them on my Delta flights ever. It's okay. I don't love, I don't hate. It tastes like a chocolate Scooby-Doo snack. It's the right. only thing is, is you can't taste the chocolate at all. No. It's kind of like the caramel. It's kind of disappointing because you want to taste the chocolate. But this one, I have a feeling we're going to taste the chocolate. This is the last snack. It's a late milk dessert 58. Coat Dior. Oh, yeah, boy. I feel like this is like gooey caramel. It's not good. I don't think it's caramel. Lassie. I think it's with another chocolate filling. Hello. Hello, sweet boy. He's like, I want a snacky. Oh, I don't like peanut butter. Yes, you do. You just tried it last night. That was different. That was like trail mix thing. No, this will be the same. You think so? Yeah. Um, I probably put that honestly. It's not peanut butter. That is the most subtle peanut butter I've ever tasted in my life. This surprises me because I'm not a peanut butter girl, but actually yesterday she's right. There's like this peanut butter trail mix. Actually, I'll show you guys. So I've never liked peanut butter, but I got these and I gave it to her. I'm like, I don't like peanut butter. And I was like, how do you try them? And she was just goo goo guying over how good they were. So I was like, fine, I'm gonna I'm try one. You know, cause I'm not allergic to peanut butter. I just don't like it. I think what it is is I don't like peanut butter, but I like chocolate peanut butter. Yeah. Like I, I love Snickers bars. Then you like Reese's? I haven't had a Reese's. Reese's is just as good as that. I think that's. Really I don't good like now. I don't like peanut M and M's because it's like a peanut. But you, you would like peanut peanut butter M and M's. But you would like peanut butter M and M's. Maybe those are better. Maybe. I don't like the nuts. Uh, yeah, it's weird. But I like the peanut butter. But this is interesting because it's the least overpowering peanut butter I think I've ever tried in my life. 
Yeah. It, it's like you can barely even tell it's peanut butter. So this is definitely really good. The only reason why I know is just the look and the taste. That was really good. All right. So I feel like we had some really good snacks out of this. Favorite? I would say my favorite was the small, obviously the Coke Dior, and then I also like the Crokey Bickies. These were really oh, good. I don't like those. And I feel like I need some of these now because I had so much chocolate. I would say my, my was definitely the Crokey Dior. I really liked this one too, the last one. I liked the wafers, the wafers are good, and I like these. These were also good, but these are like, what was that? Oh, huh. grandma. These are grandmas. Like, I would like these instead of Alexa. Well, Belgium was pretty successful. I knew it would be good once I saw Belgium. I was like, okay, chocolate. I've been doing so many snack videos, guys. This is literally like my seventh snack video I've done in a month. <laughs> So many companies are sending me so much snack stuff and then I'm subscribed to Snack Crate's monthly snacks. So like these always come every month. So I should always have a snack crate at least once a month for you guys. But man, I'm liking this niche because your girl likes to eat. I like to eat. <laughs> this is great. All right, guys. Well, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. You know the deal. Otherwise, she's going to be under your bed. Scary. I know. I'm always scary, right? <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Look at my sleeping kitty cat over here. Isn't he the Does most he handsome, distinguished you. gentleman you've ever seen in your life? Gussie and I used to not be friends. Gussie, when he was a baby, I came over and Gussie was like a little baby. He was a baby kitten. And he, was only a couple months he attacked away. my face like six o'clock in the morning, like wet for it. <laughs> he was a crazy kitten, like literally the most crazy. insane kitten you'd ever meet. But, but he was friends. a baby. He was only like what, like not five even months. half a year, like four months when she met him. Maybe. So he was just a little psycho cat from hell. But now we're friends. We're mutuals. He's we're he's grown up we're a bit. Cordial. He's a distinguished gentleman. All right, guys. Bye. Bye. Take care of myself, no, I don't need that